What's up everyone, Dom Proof here. Today is going to be a rip sad video. Um, I, I got over it a little bit. Um, I got scammed out of basically my whole inventory except my gloves. Um, the AK Redline I rebought, but besides that, everything has been scammed. I'm going to show you the receipts and explain my stupidity. Um, I should have thought this tr through. I should not have trusted someone randomly online, even if I was in their Discord server, but you can put your opinions in the comments. Um, so basically, I started this YouTube channel mainly for Counter-Strike Go, and basically just to upload any of the highlights I get while playing MM, and uh, my case openings. I would like to thank you guys for 300 subs, We've been doing amazing on this channel so far, and I really appreciate the support. Um, but it may be on hold for a little bit, or I may not be doing as much money as I was putting, because I spent about $800 on case openings, and I was actually up $700 in total. And now I just got scammed, so that's $800 out of my pocket, and it hurts. Um, I did this with the intention, you know, of losing that $800, but when you actually, you know, make profit on the openings, um, and your stupidity gets in the way, it's kind of sad. So basically, to get into the point of the story of how I got scammed, I hit looking to play on Counter-Strike Go. And a Supreme invited me. I'm a Silver. I got re-ranked as Silver about two months ago. And I've been stuck there. Typical Silver. <laughs> but um, I've been playing this game since 2014. I just started to pick it up again during COVID. And it's been super fun ever since. Um, now I have the finances to kind of like throw a couple keys on here to open every week. So I figured I'd record it and put it on YouTube. But anyway... I got invited by a Supreme, obviously being a Silver, it's like, oh great, you know, let me join his lobby. Join his lobby. Um, he didn't want to play MM after trying to get other people to play with us. He said, okay, let's go play Face It. I said, okay, I have an account, let me just re-download it. So, I go on Face It, I join his team, and I should have looked into this, but I didn't know that there was no such thing as a CS money tournament or event. Uh, he told me to trade my skins to my alt account and check, click on the link for the rules. And my stupid ass went on the link, logged in thinking it was Steam. I thought I was so smart by looking into the link. I saw it still said steamcommunity.com. Spelt the right way, no errors or anything, slash ID, and then the whole link. Didn't check it, so I was like, alright, you know what, trustworthy guy. Don't even know this guy. He sounded like he was Russian, said he was from Boston. Barely understood what I said, but I wanted to play with him for some reason. Don't even know him. This is the, I guess, the typical scam they're looking for. And I was their prime candidate. And I logged in my Steam ID, password, verified it on the mobile thing. So I signed in with their team and on Faceit. Still looked legit as well, the Faceit website. Was able to log in, had my old account, and I sent the trade. I'll show it to you right now. Go to trade offers. And I sent it on my phone. Now the first one failed to go through for some reason. As you can see here. That was what I was trying to send it to. It wouldn't work. Wouldn't work. As you can see, this is where they the bot automatically sent um, their offer. I canceled that as well. Canceled that as well. And then I accidentally canceled my own offer. And then they let the bot offer go through. They did my same exact um, second account picture. And had my same name. So you can see my name is Dom. 
or DOM proof on my profile usually. And I named it DOM alt just to know it's me and it didn't even work. So I thought I was sending it to I thought I was sending it to this account, which I have 87 hours. So this is my alt account. I only have Counter Strike on here. I have my friends. And I didn't even check on my browser to see that this was a level zero account. And if you go into their inventory, they have my M9 bayonet that I spent four or $400 on and held it for a year. My AK red line that I had for about two years. My favorite deagle that I had. I had it to the moon. Op red line. My two silk tigers that I unboxed. My wildfire that I unboxed. Cyber security. This gun. Another gun that I unboxed during the silk tiger openings. And they also took my MAC-10 Stalker. So, total worth about $1,200. All gone. Just me trying to play a face-it tournament that wasn't even real. The only thing that I'm left with is the gloves that I just unboxed, which is on my channel. And it's only because they were trade banned and I got lucky. I still have this skin that I unboxed as well. And I have my M9 Bulldozer. And I'm lucky because I actually forgot that I had this skin. Because they said any skins in the rules on the website over 10 to $20 I need to submit that aren't trade on trade hold. Which was another dead giveaway. And I didn't see it. I was naive and I didn't even think about it. And yeah. So that is what I'm left with. I only have a pair of gloves. So I had an $1,800 inventory. Now it's worth about $350. <sighs> so this is just an awareness. If someone asks you to play a face it tournament and to trade your skins to your alt account, don't do it. Um, there is a Reddit post from 2019 that someone lost $70 in skins doing this as well. So I should have looked this up. But, again, I was in the Discord server, so they make it more of a friendly experience, like you're going to play with the people, so you can trust them, and obviously don't trust anyone. Not even someone that just wants to hold your skin, because they could just take it and run. Um, just be careful for any random friend requests. Just block them. Don't even try to play with them. Only play if you're going to play MM or face it, and it doesn't involve trading skins. Because you could lose $1,500 on skins like me. Um, but yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like and subscribe if you want to see more unboxings. Thanks you guys again for 300 subs. I really appreciate it. Um, and if you could share this video for awareness. I'd really appreciate it. This has been Dom Proof. Hope you guys enjoyed. Have a great day.